Hey guys, thank you for stopping by. I just wanted to make this quick video for two reasons. One of them being that I was finally able to finish business with the Idris that managed to get away from the Xeno threat video and actually see it blow up in a beautiful spectacle. And the other reason is to thank you guys for the support on the recent videos and on the channel because we finally managed to reach 100 subs and it was a lot quicker than I had anticipated. So thank you for all the tips that were left in the comments to help me improve my videos and tips to become a better player in Star Citizen. Clearly this is just a start and I want to continue with this adventure and would love to have you guys join me. Once again a really big thank you and yeah let's get to destroying this Idris. So you may be wondering why I'm in a cuddy and that's because I actually rented this ship to do the cargo transport aspect of the Xeno threat mission. However the server that I joined was actually done with most of the missions um, or most of the Xeno threat mission and we're on the final verge of destroying the capital ships which are the Idris. The Idrises, there are two that spawned I believe. So yeah, I mean without thinking any further I just joined in on the battle and helped them out. I basically emptied my whole uh, missile rack on this one Idris and got some good hits in but they just weren't enough so I spun up the ship weapons and got to work. So I did some flybys and bombarded the Idris with all of my lasers but then I got into this flow state circular attack pattern and started dealing some real damage. I mean it was perfect speed and rotation and the enemy weapons weren't able to hit me so yeah I just kind of went about this pattern and just kept emptying all of my ammo and into the ship. I mean the battle was going very smoothly from my end until I think I got hit by a missile and my ship just went totally like, I don't know, uncontrollable, I mean it was just all over the place but I managed to regain control of it back again and let me just say man, even without a right engine I still wasn't out of the battle.
out of the blue, this massive torpedo nuke just flew into the Idris, and I mean, the explosion was just magical. It was a direct hit, and at the end, even if my Cuddy was on the verge of destruction and probably gonna blow up any time, in the same fashion, it ended up having the last laugh after all. I sat around the wreck a bit longer just admiring the mini explosions of the Idris and I would have loved to get a up close look at the wreck but man my ship just couldn't fly straight for obvious reasons um, but yeah I mean I just waited here until rescue came and I just want to say that this was probably my favorite experience that I've had playing Star Citizen so far. So rescue came and I was able to safely get to Port Tressler, but I think this is a great time to end this video. I mean, I know Xenothreat is a big issue for servers and player experience, but when it works right, man, it's, it's a lot of fun. Though I have been trying to do the cargo transport aspect of this mission, but it never seems to work. I mean, I just get hit with 30k in between, so yeah, I mean, that part isn't fun, but the overall experience that I've been having is decent, especially for my first time experiencing an event this big in, in the game itself. But, you know, for future plans, I mean, maybe we'll just end the Xeno Threat stuff here and continue with the 0 to 1 million series where I was supposed to be prospector mining, so be on the lookout for that. And I just want to say thank you for watching this video. Thank you for the 100 subs. Like the video if you've enjoyed and subscribe if you want to see similar content. And with that being said, I hope you have a great day and I will see you in the next one. Peace.